welcome back to HGTV Handmade with us, the Crafty Lumberjacks. If you're like us, you're on the winter struggle bus. All the lights and the Christmas decorations are away, and we wanted to add some warm light into our Valentine's decorations. So we're gonna be creating these awesome uh, light boxes made of cereal boxes. Yeah, so the first thing you need to do is eat all the cereal. <laughs> I love cereal. I love cereal. <laughs> We'll take this out, and then you're gonna to want to open the box carefully. You can use an X-Acto knife or a ruler, just something to help you um, open this carefully. Ooh. And this is gonna act as the frame for your light box. Uh, for the next step, we're going to trace out our hole about an inch wide uh, to create like a television screen almost. We love Valentine's Day decor. It also is like a good transition like out of Christmas. Um, you know, cause then your apartment seems, or your house seems so empty after Christmas, all the decorations are yeah. away. So we like to jump right into Valentine's Day. We do. We decorated for Valentine's Day this year. I on think, New Year's. On New Year's. Uh, and now I'm just gonna carefully cut it using an X-Acto knife just on these lines here that I made. So we're gonna take this out, give it a coat of spray paint. We're gonna use a navy blue, but you can use a white, a pink, whatever color you like. Yeah, and if you don't feel comfortable spray painting, acrylic paint will work fine, but for a streak-free version, spray painting is the best. Now we're gonna work on our inserts. We are making our inserts on vellum paper or shrinkable paper. Vellum paper is just plastic, translucent paper. We did try this on tissue paper. If that's all you have, it will work, but it does warp a little bit when you start to glue. Yeah, we also tried with parchment paper and that worked as well, but we want, wanted something a little thicker, sturdier. Yeah. And this will be nice because you can swap it out, you can save it year to year. All right, so vellum paper and tissue paper. So we had a lot of scrap pieces of tissue paper from the holidays and we decided to reuse them and it worked out really well. Even if it's wrinkly, that's okay. A little texture adds a little pizzazz. Um, so we're picturing a heart with uh, rays of sunshine coming out from it. What do you Lovely. think? Do you like that idea? I do. All right, now we're gonna glue everything down with a glue stick. Now don't worry about uh, the glue stick kind of going everywhere because you really want your tissue paper edges to be lying flat and plus when the light is on you won't see the streaks of the glue stick. So now that Andrew made our lovely design here on the uh, vellum paper, mm -hmm. um, we're just going to trim the edges. Um, it's just tissue paper so it cuts off really easily. Um, and then we thought it'd be fun to add uh, some wording to our light box here. So we're gonna use vinyl stickers and just uh, create a little phrase on the paper as well. Yeah, we're putting it on another piece of vellum paper and we're just going to lay it on top when we create the box. This way it's easier. I feel like if you add the stickers to the tissue paper and you line it up incorrectly, then yeah, it looks whole, crooked or something. It looks crooked, the tissue paper rips off, so this yeah. is much easier. Oh, that looks great. So cute. And we're gonna go for a phrase, say love. Everybody say love. Everybody say love. <laughs> and while Andrew is adding the vinyl stickers, I'm just gonna prep our light box here. We're just gonna add a bit of white paper to the back of the box, uh, just so it really helps our image pop. We cut a little hole in the back for our LED lights. You're gonna wanna make sure you use an LED light just because we're working with paper and cardboard. Yep. Um, you could also use a, a battery operated tea light for these or um, they kind of sell these little LED like globe battery. lights. Yeah, yeah, those are I pretty cute. Work like that. So now it's time to put everything together. We're going to layer our two pieces together. We're going to put our text in the front and our picture in the back so it shines through and we're gonna lay it just like that. Yeah, and we're just using a little double-sided tape for this. Um, just because we want the option to uh, take our panels out and create new ones, uh, but you can uh, use super glue, hot glue, whatever is right for you. Hey, that rhymes. Hey. That's pretty good. Lovely. So now we just wanna reconstruct our box. And we're gonna be using a little bit of hot glue for that. We also made a mini one out of a smaller cereal box. We've got our lights ready, and now we're gonna pop them in and watch it glow. Ooh. We think they'll be the perfect addition to our Valentine's Day bookshelf. Book <laughs> 
<laughs> These are great. Thank you guys for being the light of our lives. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.